Hi everyone, in this video, let's have a look at the daily wise attendance in Kadena. Before we go with the attendance module, let's go to the general settings under these settings. So here under the general setting, let's see the student attendance type and we're going to enable the daily wise attendance here and update it. And once this is done, let's move to the attendance module under academics. So here under the attendance module, the first thing that we find is the attendance register. So under the attendance register, we have the option to choose a batch. And here you can see the number of students present in the batch and their role numbers. You can sort the students based on the names or role numbers. And you can see the calendar here where we can mark absence. By default, all the students are present in Fadina. Only when a student is absent, we're going to mark absence for them by marking absence here. I can see the student and I'm going to mark absence for the student by just selecting the cell and entering a reason here. And I have an option to choose if it's forenoon or only afternoon or if both, I can choose them by enabling it and I can add it here. And once I add, you can see the cross sign that is marked here, which represents the absence of the student. This is how you can mark absence. And as you can see, for the upcoming days, you cannot mark absence for the students. Whereas for the previous set of days, you can mark absence. This allows the employees or teachers to mark absence even after the class hours. To make it more simple, we have one more option, which is called rapid attendance here. We can enable rapid attendance by enabling rapid attendance. You need not have to enter the reason. You can just select the cell and mark absence for the student. So that's all about attendance register. Let's move back to the attendance module. The next thing that we have here is the attendance report. So under the attendance report, we can choose a particular batch. Let's say I'm going to choose the report monthly and I'm going to choose the month March and the year 2016 and here you can see the report where you can see the list of students in the batch and the total number of working days where the number of working days they are present in the class and you can also see the percentage calculation again with the list of students that you have here you can filter based on any of these conditions and you can take a PDF or a CSV report the next attendance report mode that we have is an overall, which gives you an overall report. And the next one that we have is for a custom date where you can give a start date and an end date. Let me give a start date and an end date here and view a report. So now it shows the list of students and the report with the percentage calculation. Again, you can take a PDF report or a CSV report out of it. The next option that we have is the day-wise attendance report. And under day-wise attendance report, you can choose a particular class to view the absentees in that particular class in a specific date. Or you can Skip the action of not choosing any particular class or a specific date. By default, the current date will be considered and all the classes will be listed here where you can see the absentees. Let's choose one of the classes here by selecting the batch and you can get to see the students who are absent in that particular batch. Where you can take a CSV report of this so that's all about attendance module in Fadina. Thanks for listening.